Welcome to the channel everybody. So if you guys watched the previous video, you know that we are starting a new build on the channel with 2015 Nissan Titan Pro 4X. So we're already gonna start the build. This is a cat back exhaust and it is half of the exhaust I'm gonna do. So we're really just doing half the exhaust right now and getting rid of the big muffler and replacing it with a smaller one. And then later, there are two resonators and two catalytic converters on this truck that we are going to get rid of with a set of long tube headers and catless mid pipes. A lot of times people unbolt these, I'm just gonna cut them off. See, is this hot? It's warm, it's not too hot. Uh, this shot is certainly interesting. Is it? Why is that? Can you, can you explain why? Um, it's just your crotch and legs kind of flailing with a tube. It's mighty rusty. It really is, like, look at this end right here. See? Like, that's how it's supposed to look, just like not rusty. And look at this, completely just it is, it is what it is. So obviously I'm not gonna run it like this. We're gonna put the new exhaust on, and it'll sound better than the old exhaust. But let's just go in and start it real quick like this. Just to hear this thing loud. Zach, you wanna do that? So yeah, we're gonna do that. So you can see the exhaust that we took off. Here's the old muffler and all the old exhaust where it connected. Then the old pipe on the back with a lot of rust. And here's the new muffler and the new pipes. We're at the, I guess you could say, fun part of the install where we're just installing all the new pipes to the old ones and stuff. And it's pretty nice just seeing new parts go on the truck, especially because all the old ones are really rusty. All right, everyone, so the new exhaust is actually on, kind of. You guys, you guys can see. There's the MBO pre muffler. Goes all the way back. It looks a lot better. It's not, you know, rusted out and terrible. So it's definitely louder than stock, and it doesn't sound bad, but it's just not loud enough. Now, I'm kind of at a crossroads here. Do I get a weld shop to delete that muffler that is on this exhaust, or do I wait to get the full uh, catless exhaust, then see how it sounds, and then make the decision? I don't know yet, we'll see. That is way too quiet. Um, so like I said, only half of the exhaust is done, so maybe when we put the other half in it, I'll love the sound, and then I'll be like, okay, perfect, because it will be a lot louder. Those cats are huge on there, and then also the resonators that are after the cats are pretty big. Maybe once I get the second exhaust on there, I'll be happy with it, but we'll see what happens all right everybody so it's been a few days since i installed the new cat back exhaust on the truck and i don't like it yeah i don't like it it is technically louder than stock but whenever you're inside of the vehicle you pretty much don't even notice and also the only thing you do really notice is drone and if you don't know what drone is it's like a loud humming sound all the time that's all you really notice with this exhaust you don't notice the good parts i had an idea today where the two pipes go into the mufflers i'm going to replace it with these i can't just have it open because then it'll be throwing exhaust fumes at some electronics and a lot of people just cut their mufflers off the titans the newer titans and then they end up having electronic issues so i got these to push the exhaust fumes down also they kind of look cool it'd be kind of cool to have that under the truck once my exhaust is cooled off we're gonna unbolt that muffler and we're gonna put these on. And it's gonna be a lot louder. Guys, look at how awesome that looks. I gotta get the, um, those stickers will burn off. But I'm just gonna bolt these in and then we'll be done. And this thing will sound so much meaner. Yeah, idle's pretty quiet. Honestly, that's not, it starts up quiet and idle's quiet. I'm gonna interrupt the video really, really quick. One thing I wanna tell you guys is that my microphone broke on my camera, so I don't have a microphone on my camera right now. It's just the one that comes with the camera. It's kinda of terrible. So it makes everything sound a little bit more like sharp, high-pitched, raspy, or whatever you wanna say. Uh, so my exhaust actually sounds a little more rattly than usual, and I kinda of don't know why. I think the camera, whenever it hears something that loud, can't register it perfectly. So it kind of substitute and it just, it doesn't sound how it does in real life. It sounds a little bit more rattly and raspy than it is in real life. It's really not like that. It's a lot deeper. It's a little bit raspy and that's going to be corrected soon. But in the meantime, it's a little bit raspy, but the camera makes it sound a lot more raspy than it is. So yeah, don't judge it too bad. Raspy, but again, it's not the final sound of the exhaust. 
but uh, it's better than before. That sounds nothing like a truck. Like it sounds like a VK56, which is the engine that's in it, but oh my gosh, it sounds so good and it's it's so easy, like I barely have to get on it and it does that. It sounds, man, I'm gonna break this truck fast now that it's loud. But, oh my gosh, I love this so much. <laughs> it's just so, it's happened to that. <laughs> I'm not gonna be a mule, I, I, I'm, I, I, I got something to do, I gotta go do boom, boom, boom. All right guys, so we wanted to get some uh, clips of the exhaust afterwards, really, really loud, but we, it was kind of a, but it wasn't really a good time to go to the, God, I can't block. Out of a trillion, 600 billion, four, a, a trillion, 400 billion, out of a billion, 400 million, excuse me, a trillion, 400 billion dollars. It's hard to even say it. It wasn't really a good time to go to the area where we got the shots before, so we decided to come to a different area. And we're out on a dirt road right now where it's nobody around, it's much better for this. And um, some people, on the channel, actually like everybody should recognize this because if you're on this channel, you've seen that video. Mm -hmm. You may recognize this, this little uh, jump thing right here. And all this. Man, it's, it's grown up since Game serial flipped. That's where we hit. So guys, if you guys don't know, this is where we flipped in the Subaru a while back, over a year ago. We sideswiped that tree right there and then we took out, we hit it 70 miles an hour, by the way. We went straight into here, sideswiped that tree, took out all this greenery, and then we hit one of the trees up there and then flipped right there. Backfired so loud. So, guys, as you can tell, the truck is way, way louder and way more fun this way. And I think it sounds great. Those pops and backfires it was doing whenever you were revving it were so cool. I've never heard a pop before. Yeah, me either. I don't. I actually kind of don't know how you really did that. I've been trying to do that. Actually, here, let me stop. I'm gonna try and rev it, and I'm gonna try and get it to pop like that. Really fast and light. Really fast and light. Like that. Like that with your foot. <laughs> I think I see what you mean, hold on. Well, all right, well, whatever. Apparently you're the master of making this thing backfire. Yeah, oh, you know, it's got sound a JVM vehicle. That's right. Thanks for stopping in on the video, everybody. We have a lot of cool content coming with this truck. Like the exhaust, that's just one thing, but the exhaust actually is not done. In case you guys didn't catch that in the video, we have a whole nother half of it coming, which is gonna be long tube headers and a catless med pipe. Not exactly sure when I'm gonna order that um, and make that happen, but it will be a little bit later because the next thing that we're doing is really expensive and a lot more in depth than that. So that takes a lot more commitment. But next week will be one of the biggest mods, technically three mods, technically 
to this truck that we'll ever do. I mean, it's gonna be huge. So go ahead and subscribe so you don't miss out on next week's content. We're gonna have so much fun next week on this channel. Like there's been probably eight videos that I've ever made where I'm like, that was a lot of fun. And I have a feeling next week's gonna be a lot of fun. So go on ahead and subscribe so you don't miss out on next week because next week is gonna be super fun. So with that being said, go and subscribe to the notification bell, browse the rest of the videos, and uh, I'm out.